Hi friends, Miss Carrie here from the West Haven Public Library and welcome to the mini garden craft how-to video. Let's go over all the supplies that you should have received in your kit from the library. You should have a flower pot, some paint, some soil, some seeds, a wooden stick, a sponge paintbrush, and a regular paintbrush. Okay, now that we've gone over all our supplies, let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is paint our flower pots. You can paint them any way you'd like, or you don't even have to paint it at all. It's all up to you. I mixed my white and purple paint together to make a pretty lavender color. Once you're done painting your flower pot, just let it sit and dry completely before you add the soil and the seeds. So once your flower pot has dried, it's time to start gardening. So what you're going to need is your soil, your seeds, and some water. You can also use a spoon or a gardening tool if you'd like to put your soil in your flower pot, or you can just use your hands. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is place our soil in our flower pot. I don't have a spoon right now, so I'm just going to pour it in. And just spread it around with my hands. My soil's all set in my flower pot, and now it's time to add our seeds. So what we're going to do is just make little indentations in the soil with our fingers. If you can do about four of them, that's fine. Maybe about half of an inch apart. And then we're going to put some seeds in each little indentation. And one or two seeds is fine for each. And once you've added your seeds, you're going to gently cover them up again with some dirt. Just gently cover it with a little blanket. And now we're going to add some water. So just make sure that you add enough water that your soil is nice and moist. It's going to drink it up. Once you're done adding the water to your soil, you're going to place your flower pot in a nice sunny window or a nice sunny location in your home. And hopefully in the next week or two, you should see some buds. And what you can do once you start seeing some buds, you can add this stick and this can work as a trellis because the morning glories like to grow upward. They like to grow on trellises and hopefully this will help them do that. Okay, my friends, that is all the time we have for our special gardening program today. I hope that you enjoyed gardening and painting your flower pot and I hope that you are enjoying your summer and that I get to see you very soon. Have a good day.